Hey, good morning everyone. This is Joseph from YPN Academy. Okay. Um, in this particular video tutorial, we are going to be showing you five amazing things that VS Code can do. Are you still there? Five amazing things that VS Code can do. Okay, if you are with us, let's jump right in. Okay. First, you can change your theme on VS Code. The theme, the ap appearance of your VS Code as a color theme, you can change it. Okay, to do that, you come to this uh, icon that looks like the SETI icon, they call it Manage there. Okay, you click on it, go to Color Team, Color Team. Okay, yes, this is the list of color, color themes you have. Okay, you can just scroll down and choose the one that you feel most appealing to you the most okay so these are this is what you have you have red solarize tomorrow night blue high contrast a whole lot of them light visual studio so yes you can just choose any one you you like okay so for me i prefer to stick with dark default color the dark default color so press enter there okay so the number two or the list is probably you are working on your vs code and you don't want to see all these desktop icons okay they are taking some space um on your screen <coughs> okay you need a large work space a large work environment all you need to do is to just switch to the full screen uh, full screen mode Okay, to do that, you simply press your con your F11. You hit your F11 button. Okay, just do that. Yes, this is the full screen mode. Okay, you have last space to work on, and um, you can um, work. The work environment is large, and you can do a lot there. Okay, let me just go back on that. Okay, the third one. This one is amazing naturally okay you can actually be able to split um your screen your working screen you can split it into as many um component as you wish probably you, you want to work on uh html css or javascript okay and uh you don't want to uh, combine it. you you want to be working on different uh, screen so you can split your screen into three or four on places and be doing um each each um writing each code on um they are separate either for html css or javascript okay let's to do that you hold your control button and you press the you know the backward slash the backward slash look of look for the backward slash on your keyboard you press it okay you see it has split it into two screen you press again three screen as many so let's just close that off okay all right um the fourth one on the list is you want to you need to focus on what you are doing probably you are typing at something okay ypn this is a good program so you need to focus on what you are doing you need to you know zoom in okay so this feature allows you to zoom in and have you know a focus on what you are actually working on so to do that you hold your control and the plus icon on your keyboard see it helps you to zoom in you are able to focus and see what you are doing um quite um you see it very well okay yes to so to zoom out you hold the control key and the minus sign on your keyboard okay you zooming out okay. that's it that's it the last but not the least is you can actually comment out your line the lines of your code okay probably you have, you have this um ypn academy this is a good you have it um or your you write you wrote this line of code but you don't want it to display on your browser you don't want it to display on your browser so what you just need to do is to comment out this line once you comment it out it's not going to display on your browser there's a short code for doing that okay all you need to do is 
to hold your control and click your forward slash um slash key you know the last time we talked about backward slash now you press your your forward slash key once you do that it has comment out this line so it's not going to show on your you know on your browser so it's not going to display so you have comment out this line so if you are following thanks try this on your vs code and you you see there are many more so these are just the five we're able to do now okay try try it out see you in the next training bye